Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys are wondering where I am, I am currently inside of a 1977 VW or Volkswagen camper bus. Uh, in today's video, I'm gonna give you guys a tour of my hippie bus and explain some background behind it and then let you guys know the restoration process which I'm going to be going through. Uh, it's gonna be a very hard journey, but I'm so excited and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright you guys, so I thought I would start off today's video by giving you guys some background on the bus real quick. This bus was purchased by my dad in Washington State. Uh, the outside paintings and drawings, which you guys will see, were done by a local Seattle artist named Henry. Uh, I don't know too much information about the artist, but I can definitely look into it if anyone is curious. Uh, the bus is a 1977 Bay Window bus, camper bus. And yeah, I'm super excited to get the restoration process started. And if anyone has any advice and comments for me uh, regarding restoration, please leave them down below. I am welcoming any advice. I'm definitely going to need it. All right, you guys, so let's get the tour of the bus started. So as you guys enter the bus from the one door, there is a mirror over here, and then there is the loft uh, bed portion over up here, as well as the window latch up on top. Continuing from the door to the front, ignore those holes by the way, I'm definitely gonna have to fix those. Here are the mechanics of the front of the bus. Uh, it does work, it is a functioning bus mechanics wise, so there's that. Um, it has these lovely green seats and it does actually have seat belts, which is super cool. Um, yeah, over on this side of the bus, it has a little fire extinguisher along with a little vent, these beautiful green little curtains that I'm definitely going to have to replace all throughout the bus. I'm not quite sure what fabric or color scheme I'm even going to go with for this bus, but I definitely like the wooden uh, tones of it for sure. This is what it looks like as I walk towards it. Uh, it also has this portion right here, which is, I guess, the kind of like the kitchen section of the bus. Um, there's some storage areas right here, as you guys can see, and then I believe there's more storage under there as well. And that's what the seat looks like, like that. So this is what the front of the bus looks like. It's quite tall and it has some birds on the front as well as some tires. And then if we continue to the side of the bus, um, you might be able to see me through the windows, but it has all of these drawings all over the side. There's a lovely octopus, peace signs, some dogs, and a heart over there. As far as restoration goes, I'm definitely going to need to replace the windshield. As you guys can see, it has multiple uh, cracks and I guess fractures. I don't know if that's the right word to use, but all along the uh, windshield of the bus. So I thought I would give you guys a quick rundown on what my ideas are as far as restoration goes real quick. So I definitely need to uh, restore the windshield because as you guys saw, it has a lot of cracks and dents in it. Um, I think there's a bullet hole in it. <laughs> I definitely need to restore the inside. A lot of it is very questionably. <laughs> I'm not super fan of the green color scheme. I definitely need to replace the curtains, uh, paint the outside. Honestly, I'm still trying to figure out whether I should paint the outside or not. You guys can let me know in the comments down below. I really like the artwork, but it's not my personal uh, artistic style. So I was thinking doing it like a baby blue, a sage green, or maybe like a purple color and then maybe painting like rainbows and mushrooms and maybe some psychedelic art on the outside you guys let me know what you guys think and yeah like i mentioned i ended up going on pinterest and finding some inspiration as far as the art that was a super cool bus that i found i also really liked this blue color and then also the next color that you'll see that's kind of like that sage green tone that i was talking about i don't know if we'll end up painting it this color but i thought it was cool and I just wanted to say a quick thank you to all of my amazing subscribers. Thank you so much to everyone who has recently subscribed. And if you haven't yet already, make sure to do so. I'm going to be renovating this bus within the next year or so, or at least a few months. We'll see what I have time for because I am a busy college student. But thank you to everyone so much for subscribing. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video.